New at 5, a new program helping incarcerated individuals get a fresh restart. Many prisoners signing to earn college degrees from a program led by Cal State LA, but they're still having trouble finding jobs after they're released. Eyewitness News reporter Annabelle Munoz shows us how a new grant will help them get jobs. Alan Burnett was serving a life sentence without the possibility of parole when he sought the opportunity to earn a bachelor's degree in communication. I never thought I was going to get out of jail, you know. But Governor Gavin Newsom commuted Burnett's sentence, and in 2020, he was released. He later enrolled at Cal State LA to finish earning his degree and has since earned a master's and co-founded a nonprofit. It was literally one of those things that really changed my life. You know, it gave me a different perspective on, you know, what the world could look like, you know, through the lens of education. Since 2016, almost 40 students have graduated through Cal State LA's Prison BA Graduation Initiative. It's offered at California State Prison in Lancaster, and another program was launched at a women's prison in Chino. This was a real opportunity for me to change not only my life, but the lives of those around me. But graduates like Burnett and Dion Whitmore understand the real-life limitations formerly incarcerated people and graduates face. It was scary to see and know that simply having a college education and a degree just wasn't enough. Now, through a $900,000 grant from the U.S. Department of Justice, Cal State L.A. created the Prison to Careers Equity Pathway Program. The grant allows us to provide them with coaching, mentoring, paid internships, um, you know, leadership skills, all the kinds of things that a lot of other students um, may already have a little bit of a leg up. The Pathway Program is one of several at Cal State LA to support formerly incarcerated students. I feel like it's going to pay dividends in the end. Through these efforts, many have formed meaningful, lifelong friendships and carved new paths. Happy birthday to you! With support from the grant, Whitmore, who was released from prison a few months ago, received coaching, landed a paid internship, and will soon start a new full-time position. For a lot of the guys who, uh, who are will be who are and will be going through the same things that uh, I'm going through. It's definitely like stay the course. Annabelle Munoz, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Welcome.